given, that's how we live it. Don't be mad at the system, it's simply how we've existed. Hello beautiful people, it's your girl D Virgo, also known as D Virgo Tarot 2222, coming at you from London in the heart of this pandemic. Um, just coming this morning, on a Monday morning, with a little word for Leo. A short four card reading, I'm gonna do a word for Leo. So just trying to see where the spirit guides me to which tarot card I wanna choose. And I think today, we'll use my baby pack. The cards have already been pre-shuffled, but I'll say it again, I will pre-shuffle it one more time so you can see that it's been done. Also, my messages are timeless, so whenever you see this message is when it's supposed to reach you. And even though it's tied to Leo, if it resonates with you, then this message is for you, babes. For you and you and you. So clear, concise messages for Leo, spirit. Clear and concise messages for Leo. What do you want Leo to know at this time, spirit? Clear and concise messages for the sign of Leo. Oh. Oh. Your first card is the devil. The devil, Leo. Is this you? Or is that person or that thing? This card symbolizes lots of different things. This is the thing that's holding you back in your life. So for a lot of you Leos today, sorry why I just grease my hands a bit, they're looking a little bit shiny. For a lot of you Leos today, this is the energy that you're feeling. You're feeling a bit conflicted and low at this point. I don't know if it's outside influences, but this tells me that some of you are dealing with addictions in your life. This is the time to face these addictions. You have time. Go cold turkey. Whether it's weed or the hard stuff or drink, porn, whatever this is. Girls, men, This card is calling for you to deal with what's wrong in your life. The thing that's keeping you up in your life. The thing that's keeping you stagnated. The devil card symbolizes those things that keeps us stagnated. That makes us feel trapped and imprisoned. Leo, this is not a bad card. This is just calling you out on your shit. This is exposing some shit. Whatever it is that you're masking with that smile, this card is telling you, deal with it. Now is the time in the month of April. This is one of the things that's holding you back from where you need to be. I don't need to tell you, this is not for everyone. Because for some people, this card is their job. It's their husband, it's their marriage. It's not been working, but here you are making it work for the kids. But are the kids really happy? Because if you're not happy, how are they happy? For those of you in situations that you're not happy with and dealing with addictions that you feel that you can't overcome, I'm here to tell you that you can. You can, Leo. I overcame domestic violence. I overcame domestic violence. Sorry about my speech. I had a slight accident. But I won't let it stop me. You can overcome every obstacle that you are facing today. Even those addictions. I've beaten a few. Have faith in yourself, Leo. You can do it. Can I have another card? For Leo, please, spirit. Clear and concise messages for Leo, please, spirit. What does Leo need to know at this time, please, spirit? Can you clarify the devil card, please, spirit, for some of these viewers, please? 
Oh, I see two cards wanting to pop out. Okay. So some of you, it's the love of money. Or the lack thereof. You're making either the lack of money put you in a place of stagnation when you should understand that you're rich without money. But if you really wanted to attract money, your energy needs to change. Because from this card it says, if you deal with this devil, deal with this devil in your life. Whatever it is, I'm not here to be a psychic and tell you, oh, it's that. You know what this is. Deal with it. Because it's stagnating you from your growth. Look at all that growth. You're not, you're not even nowhere where you're supposed to be right now. Because of the mindset. These cards are telling you your mindset needs to change. For growth to happen in your life. This is not just money and career. Depends on how you're looking at it yet again. I see growth in every areas of your life. This is you being contented, being inspired, making stuff happen, not waiting for it to happen to you, but you're making it happen. So I see you right now in solitude, writing down plans, getting stuff together. Maybe you've jumped online with me, doing something out here. But whatever it is, and whatever you're thinking about, you've either done it, doing it. But if not, go do it. It's going to make you some money. It's going to bring stability and peace in your life. It's going to help you deal with whatever this is. Use this. Put pen to paper. If it's a book, write about this. You can make a book out of this. This is you writing down your thoughts, your ideas. Because of this, it's inspired you. Your healing. I'm here because of my healing, my growth. It brought me here to you. And this is me. From here. This can be you, Leo. So that was the Eight of Pentacles. Sorry, I didn't tell you. But that's you making shit happen. Your next card is Temperance. Look at this. That's you. Woman of virtue. A man who knows who he is. A non-gendered person. Who stands firm in their belief. Whoever you are. Stand. But coupled with this. It tells you after you create. What you're creating. Have patience. Have patience. Stand. Temperance tells you. You are connected. You are connected to the divine. Take time to seek wisdom within yourself. We all have a connection to the divine, to the universe, to God. But sometimes we set ourselves or we have things in our life that are blocking us. Blocking us from hearing the voice from using our intuition, from following that dream. But this card tells me everything's gonna go right for you. Everything that you've done here in this month of April, you have nothing to worry about, Leo. Absolutely nothing to worry about. My God, my God. 
I was going to draw another card for you, but you know what? The card was drawn when I turned it over to the base. Because, my God, look at that. You know, there's things in your life that you need to kill. Kill it, Leo. Because it's stopping you. Or it is the thing that is going to make you the money. For me, this thing was the abuse that I suffered in my life as a child. It changed my perspective on the world and made me into an angry, horrible person. Negative, full of negativity. But the minute that I dealt with this devil and I accepted this devil and I forgave, yeah, I did. I didn't do it for him. I didn't do it for her. I did it for me. Leo, whatever it is you're facing, I don't know if no one's told you, but you can do it. It's stopping you. It was stopping me. But you know what? I dealt with it. And now I feel so much stronger for it. Yeah, I cry sometimes. But it's good tears. It's tears of release. Tears of acknowledgement. I no longer push it under the carpet. It's part of who I am. It's part of who you are. Use it. Let it inspire you. Let it inspire you to make shit happen. To write a book, to write a blog. To inspire others. And how you got there and how you got out. That passion is going to make you money. This is you, Leo. Calm, peaceful, serene. In this time, I feel your energies. And for those of you that are panicked and making the fear overtake you, Tap into this energy. Take a deep breath in. Lay it out. You're a star. You've got nothing to worry about. This car tells you, Leo. What are you waiting for? The world. Couldn't say it better myself. The universe has the world to offer you. For some of you, someone wants to offer you the world. This could easily be a love spread. But whatever it is, You have to deal with the devil in your life. You have to deal with the devil in your life. Because this is what's waiting for you. The world. Leo, keep safe in this time. Send in love and light. Are we gonna play now? Ready for the show? I'm about to take down, you already know Get the fuck out of my face now, yeah you got